Four-time Bundesliga champions Werder Bremen, along with their coach Florian Kohlfeldt, snatched a relegation playoff place away from Fortuna Düsseldorf on the last day of the season to set up a two-leg all-or-nothing meeting with Bundesliga two-side Heidenheim. Frank Schmidt's side were also unexpectedly in the playoff after Hamburg failed to get the point they needed on the final day. With so much riding on the results over two legs, it came as no surprise that both sides were cautious in their build-up. Heidenheim, who'd never breathed the lofty air of the top flight, had the best opportunity of a dreary first half when Maurice Multaup shot wide. Frank Schmidt, born and bred in Heidenheim, knew his side should have done better than nil-nil at the break. Bremen legend and board member Marco Borda knew it too. Heidenheim weren't overawed by the fact that they were up against a former European Cup winner's Cup winning side. Ten minutes after the break, their top scorer Tim Kleindienst pounced on a Milos Velkovic error to shoot, but his effort was another one wide of the mark. Neither side had managed a shot on target to this point as nerves got the better of both of them. With still over a quarter of an hour to play and with the introduction of Mark Schnatterer, Heidenheim's club captain and talisman, the visitors looked more dangerous. But still, the last shot on target failed them. With three minutes to play, Bremen were reduced to ten men after Nicholas Moisander brought down Sebastian Griesbeck. After picking up the first yellow card after 17 minutes, Moisander, like everyone else on the pitch, had been careful not to make any mistakes until that one. Ten-man Bremen were reinvigorated and actually made inroads into the stubborn Heidenheim defence. In the 90th minute, Manon Busch, a former Bremen player, stopped his old side from taking a late lead, clearing a Josh Sargent effort. Florian Kofeld was feeling the pressure. Directly afterwards, the visitors could have grabbed the upper hand in the tie, but Timo Biermann's header went the way of 99% of the shots. Frank Schmidt seemed as frustrated as his opposite number, but the game ended a fair nil-nil with neither side willing to risk too much, knowing that there was still an all-or-nothing second leg to play. Hello? Yes, you. Where are you going? The Bundesliga on YouTube. Subscribe now. <laughs> we are the Bundesliga.